Hey guys, how are you doing? I want to show you how I used Automatio to basically create a custom bot that will go on Magic Eden uh, and collect this information, uh, which is basically how, how many NFTs are meeting for Carmando's collection, and then do some calculation in a Google spreadsheet to actually display information like this over here. Actually, to create a bot that will go, as you can see, it's, this is an app that will say, hi, one Caramanos got me in the last 10 minutes. And this is, uh, I found it useful because we have this uh, slow mint, uh, as you are probably a very few uh, part of Caramanos community, um, that's, um, that's go slow and, you know, we we need some kind of a ping when the new action happens, kind of boost uh, the moral and everything. But anyway, um, apart to this, a bot. I also created some useful bots over here. For example, Solana NFT market stats. Basically, collect this information from Sniper, and it's also take put this screenshot over here to see the current market statistics. And I think it's very useful, you know, to have this most kind of important piece of data uh, on the daily market NFT market. Also, I added some since the meme coins are in kind of hype. I added the uh, one that track the top gainer. In this case, it's Punk, some coin. There's a link to it. I I am collecting this from CoinRack. And here are those bots. I already have. This is my dashboard, and I already have a bunch of bots or instances. In this case, here's the sniper uh, bot um, over here. Or actually, I open it over here. I can go and edit this. And as you can see, this is the bot I created. I created it very simply. I said, hey, wait, take a screenshot, mark me this data, and so on. If you want me to show you very quickly how I can build a bot, uh, let me do it over here for, for Magic Eden. Uh, basically, opening a Chrome, automated Chrome extension. And I can, now I can just say, hey, using Extract Action, go and collect me, let's say, this uh, information. And I want to get this info also this once i have the bot i can set up hey trigger yourself every five or ten minutes which i currently do and just you know create and run this bot once i do that basically the bot will be shown here and it will start uh, run as you can see it's automated it will run in seven minutes it's gonna go to a magic key then collect this data and put in the google sheet in this case you can download csv we have the api um, that we can use in other application that where other application can use or simply in the Google sheet. And here I al already have opened this Google sheet. Here we run some formulas to basically parse the data uh, to get some difference, how many, you know, NFTs were there sold in that time range and so on. Same we do for, for other bots, coin make, uh, coin ranking to, uh, to detect these mean coins uh, for sniper and so on. The, the very powerful thing is when Automatio connect with other platform, in this case, I'm using ActivePiece, and this is a Zapier clone. Not sure if you know about Zapier, but Zapier basically connects thousands of different platforms, but through the standardized API. In this case, why we use Automatio for Magic Eden is because Magic Eden didn't provide API for this data. So we needed to go and collect this data directly from the website as a user. In this case, again, automated way using Automatio. And when we combine, let's say we, we get some data in Google Sheet and Google Sheet is most integrated application, you know, basically on the internet, um, you can you can distribute this data in many different platforms or applications. So here I, I, I created a bot that will collect the data. So I create a bot with Automatio to collect this data and then put in Google Sheet over here. And now we're gonna use this platform called, once again, Active Pieces, where you can create, let's say, a bot that will, on every new row added to Google Sheet, send some message to the Discord. And here you are, you got this. And that's basically very simple. You can do this 
in basically dozens of minutes or even a couple of minutes if you have everything ready. Um, you did, for example, what you can, uh, you find a new data point that valuable data that, you know, you think it's a um, key to know to be monitored out there. Either that's, you know, Jupiter liquidity pool or something like that, or whatever it is, you can automate this pretty, pretty easy. One of the kind of um, main features of automation is not just uh, getting this, uh, extracting the data from the website. Sometimes you need to make, make a click. So we have this click action. So you select the button. Sometimes you maybe need to input data first, maybe to fill the forms. So you can put uh, this data uh, into, let's say, fill the email and so on. And there's a bunch of tools out there. So Automate is not just made for collecting data, it's actually a bot that can go to the website, click some buttons, fill some, comment out, and so on. There's an infinity use case out there. But um, just a high level overview of how actually I build this. I didn't wanna go to details because it will be too long video, but uh, even probably now is a little bit longer, but it is what it is. I couldn't pack it faster. Um, yeah, that's, that's it for now. I'm going to play with, uh, share some more experiments. So peace out.